let's fix the issue of the file upload. Back to Visual Studio Code. The issue was that first, we are not keeping track of multiple images. So we are going to change this one to NAR or empty object. Likewise, the error also is going to be NAR by default. Inside the handle change, let's remove this console lock. And over here, we are not converting them into array. So let's remove that. And it's supposed to be files. And what we want is the first record. So let's remove the new errors here. So we are going to rely on the actual image, which is a new file. So over here, we are not going to loop through. So we are going to remove this logic for, for each. Then we are checking if the file size is more than one megabyte. So we are going to use the new file. And we are going to update set file error by using this, but not new errors. Likewise, here also, we are checking the type. Then down here, we don't need the set file error. But instead, we need the set file to update the state. So when I save this one and let's console log the file when it's being submitted. Let's save it and let's try out where we have some warning here, line number 29 and 30, which is this supposed to be new file. All right, so here is supposed to be new file also. And this one also as the new file. Then set file error. So let's save it and let's check where we have some warning. Line number 29, which is this. So it's supposed to be new file. Before making the request, let's change something here. For the categories, the field name you use is called file at the back end. So let's use the file over here, meaning that we need to modify the action also. So let's get back to the create category action. And here I used image. So let's use what is called the file. And here gonna be the file and here is the file. All right, now moment of truth. Let's refresh it and let's create one category and I'll call this one as accessories. And I want to use this image for accessories and add. Let's check the dev2 extension and it is pending and fulfilled. If you look inside the payload, we have the category and the image from Cloudinary. In the next video, we are going to implement the loading and then the error in case you're going to have one.